Cut off short. That's that's Oops. it, and I just think it could. I just think that one could turn into a Christmas classic. I really love it. Yeah, that's nice. And if I wish I had it during Christmas time, I would have played along with the other songs I played for Christmas. Because uh, all the and I didn't actually, play any I hit. think that song. I think that song they released. Uh, Maybe on December 23rd or something. It was really late. And I remember thinking, you know, if you guys had released that on time, maybe you could have gotten a lot more Christmas play on it. But they released it when they were ready to. And they're pretty intentional about what they do. And as I said, they have, they're extremely prolific. Um, um, and and Sunny doesn't work on writing. She just opens herself, and they just these songs just kind of materialize. So that's not really work for her, I guess. And uh, Gabe is her producer, I guess. Yeah. Yes. Mhm. I just remembered okay. something, uh, Felix. Uh, we often have conversations about. I mean, not. I mean, in general, you know. Uh, people who play music, you know, uh, we have conversations about the fact that people tell you, people just can tell you all kind of stuff about, you know, uh, they'll tell you what you want to hear, and a lot of times they tell you stuff because they have no clue. But, uh, uh, you know, sometimes because they had the bar, because whatever. But uh, do you remember, the, you know, and you got a little bit of musical background as well. Uh, I remember you took uh, accordion lessons there for a while, little while. Yeah. You remember, you remember that? Sure. Yeah. Not I even much, learned a few chords on the guitar. Exactly. Yeah, I even learned a few chords on the guitar. And this, is, and, and this is the story, and it's such a true story. It's a classic. You know, so it's a classic to tell musicians, don't let things go to your head. Okay, when people tell you how great you you are, uh, because mm-hmm. remember that time where where uh, we were playing with uh, the, my regular trio and, and it was a wedding and and the guy insisted on having four pieces. Yeah, I remember. And, and I four, four four pieces, and I said, "Okay, Felix, here you go." I would get dressed up, you know, t- a tux. You know, we found you a tux, and he, I gave you my guitar. And and uh, and and we'll plug it, you know, and and you just make believe you play. I think you you played maybe one song like Watermelon Man or some of those three chords or something, yeah. like a couple of things like that. But the, for the four hours, your your guitar was I, I had the amps and it was the amp was off. Yeah, I know. And you you did a great yeah. job just uh, mimicking as if you're playing. And at the yeah. end of the job. A few people, including the guy who hired us, said, "Oh, that, that guitar player plays really nice. I'm glad you got a fourth piece." I mean, well, you remember that? Yeah, I do, and I, I, I'll never forget it. It's. Uh... <laughs> I mean, it's not well, it's not a know, huge story, but I, it's just I think it it captures the part of the music business, you know, where people just tell you stuff. And if you if if you let it go to your head, you, you're in trouble. Yeah. Hey, I was ready to go professional after that. I was wondering if you were sorry that you you know are are you sorry you never quit your day job? <laughs> oh, uh, I'm sorry I never quit my day job, but I know I would have never survived in this. <laughs> yeah. Oh. 
No. But that's I a story that a... You, could, you could you could tell any any time you run into a musician, tell him a story. Or you know. Yeah. It's a true fact. Yeah, it is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I remember that very well. And you even paid yeah, me a couple was, of bucks. It was, also. was a it was a it was a nice gig, you know. Yeah. Well, it was a very nice wedding. Uh, someplace in Queens, I don't remember. Now, the the songs that uh, she publishes, are they for sale, or how did she distribute them? And that part, that I, I have never uh, and, and been able to wrap my brain around the how, business part. I think music has changed so drastically and dramatically since we and were I don't in the really business. Want to on that and business. and I really have no idea. Yeah. No, the reason why I say because I know that uh, she gave me a few songs and I went to try to download some more songs. And some long songs you can download and some you can't. Some you can only listen to. Right. Uh, and, that I can't tell you. And I, and I think some had a money sign next to them, so... Mm-hmm. I just no. What I'm trying to and say. And you're probably right. Get, I have I have no idea. You know, certainly if no, anyone whole wants idea. to investigate her music, you know, it's through Sonny and Gabe. Some of her sing the things that she has worked on singly. She has uh, under Sunny Moonshine. Um. Yeah, that's another name that she uses. Some. Yeah, but we're we're not her agents, and we're not her. I'm not her agent. Business I'm manager, her so we can't. Mama. So we can't really. Uh, don't really. No, no, I'm just curious. If that. somebody, sure. if somebody listening to us wants to, you know, to listen to the music, you know, just by me playing a couple of the songs, and then they have more. You know, if she has more songs, it'd be nice for them to know how to, how to, you know, get the music or retrieve it or listen to it. Right, and and you know, all I would know is to go on, as you said, uh, to you go what, on what you went on. They can call you, you can yeah. call me, and I'll sell it to them. <laughs> yeah, right. The uh, other thing is, uh, whoever is listening, and you could tell that to uh, Sonny, and also this will be this show will be on iHeart in a couple of days as a blog. And it'll also be on iTunes in a couple of days. You know, okay. so if she wants to let anybody listen to it, she can, you know, it sounds impressive that she's a, uh, she was on iTunes. And also on right. I, and more 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 on iHeart, I think. I think that's a little bit more impressive. Mm-hmm. Because, you know, it's something to tell somebody who knows. Maybe right. you know one person uh, will catch, or will listen to it, and will catch on, and all of a sudden, absolutely. Who knows? And I know that she had. Uh, I know that they were um, recording today, so she's had. She's had a big day. She and Gabe, when they collaborate, they get together for a couple of days at a time, and um, and work really long hours. So I'm sure that's why you're not hearing from her tonight, but. Thanks for giving her the thanks for giving her the playtime, Phil, and um, did, and it's been great to talk hear, to you. Did you ever hear the song called "Foot in Water"? Yes. Is it yes. "Feet in Water"? How is that song? I think song? it's "Feet in the Water," maybe. Feet in water, yeah. Feet in the water. Feet in. Yep. I want to play that. Let's see what. Good. Let's hear it. Marco Polo ain't hurt nobody. Eyes closed, you gotta listen to find me. When you get what I'm fixing. 
everything you get me. A plus for the written assignment. Footprints in the water at our secret little swimming pool. Waving like a pro, cause I've been learning just like middle school. You know, listen to the music. That's another really pretty song, by the way. Oh, but listen to the I music. love it, and it just reminds me. I, I, I am so impressed with how much flexibility they have in their st- in the stylism of the songs they come up with. And that particular one, I really feel like goes over into the R and B category. And sometimes it's more hip hop. And sometimes yeah. it's just a, like a Christmas dinner. I think it's just a, a pretty classic song. And then um, Amalia is rich in a very different way. I, I think they're very versatile in the styles that they perform in. No, they are. They and it's but yet it's a very distinct style. The way the songs. Start and end abruptly, not like mm-hmm. what you're and they usually evolve used to. somewhere in the middle. You know, they start up yeah. and you're not sure where it's going to go. They evolve. There's another really interesting song. If anybody is interested. 